Hey, what's up guys? This is Coach David Cutts here at Cuts Performance. And today we'll be breaking down a post I saw on social media. It's called Carbohydrates for Team Sports and What Does Game Day Look Like? So here's the post right here. I'll make sure it's on your screen. So I'll be going over it real quick. So, uh, so assuming that game day starts at some time in the afternoon, probably 1 p.m., maybe 3 p.m. Um, it says 8 a.m., eat a bowl of cereal and some milk, glass of orange juice and a banana. 9 a.m., come back with three uh, jelly on toast, or three slices of jelly on toast, and a smoothie. 11 a.m., two chicken wraps, yogurt, and three Jaffa cakes. I'm assuming they're not from America, but whatever those are, you get the picture. Uh, at noon, eating or drinking some chocolate milk and uh, a sports drink, so like Gatorade, Powerade, uh, Body Armor, whatever. And then arriving, or by the time that you arrive to the game, or the changing room for your game, then just something really light like uh, a carbohydrate gel, it says. So like the, the Gatorade little square gummies that they sell. So basically the rationale behind that is that you want to eat your solids and the heaviest foods in the morning when it's furthest away from your game time. That way your body has time to digest it and anything there won't be anything sitting on your stomach by the time you actually get to game time as opposed to trying to eat an actual lunch when your game is at 3 p.m. The, the food's still probably going to be digesting or somewhere in your stomach or intestines <laughs> and then by the time once you start moving in your actual game you're still going to feel it because it's not going to be out of your system so to speak and then also basically conversely as you're moving toward your game you should be drinking or shifting from solids to liquid so that's why at uh, about noon the only options that it gave you was or were uh, chocolate milk or sports drink both of those have good a good level of carbohydrates uh, but as well as some electrolytes that can help you in the game but since it's liquid it digests quickly and uh, it won't be sitting on your stomach the main reason that you need carbohydrates uh, to load up a lot during or before the game and during, to replenish during the game are because your muscles pretty much directly run on carbohydrates called glycogen that's stored in your muscles and then also it will be flowing through your blood tree, bloodstream that helps to replenish your muscles as you're starting to move around throughout the game. I thought it was a good infographic. I think it could be helpful to you guys and I just wanted to make this video just in case uh, there could be any confusion in regards to the article or the infographic. Uh, I hope this video helped you. If it did, please give me a, or give me a thumbs up on the like button. And uh, if you really like it and want to see more content like this or other types of content, check out the page and subscribe to Cuts Performance.